Hello, today I am going to be doing another unboxing. This is for my second Faith Box. This is a monthly subscription um, and I pay $25 and I didn't do a very good job of explaining this last time. Um, all of the products that are in here are products that support something. Um, so like last time I got a beanie and part of the proceeds go to, I want to say it was Uganda, where the, there are people there that actually knit the beanies. Um, so everything that's in here, it, they work with some sort of a foundation. So all the products give money towards something that is out there to do good. Um, so with this, the box is really cute. It says Faith Box. And I love unboxings in general because it's like just Christmas every month. Um, but these ones just really make me feel good. I mean, you know, you go to church and of course you, you live a, a good life, but it's always nice to have reminders. Um, so this one says, let us not grow weary in doing good. Galatians 6, 9. So let's go ahead and get started. Oh, just so you guys know, this one is $25 a month. And I think I've talked to you guys about this one before, um, cause you can send this as a gift, a one-time gift to somebody. Um, so if you know someone that just kind of needs a little pick me up, um, this is a really cool thing to get in the mail. If someone just kind of randomly mailed this to me and I opened it, it would probably make my day. Um, so, so far this box, the first thing we've got is a sacred, this is called sacred ordinary days. Uh, this is a planner and each day has got, looks like Every day's got um, some little reminders. So this one says, for example, like draw near to God, become present, rest your mind and your heart, reflect on your previous week with posture of humility and gratitude. Note what surfaces when you have, when have you been near to or far from God's presence? Ask God to guide your reflections to be both faithful and gracious. Reset for the week to come, moving forward in spirit and hope. And there's a little quote on the other page that says, if we ever want to know the degree to which we are enslaved by the passion to possess, all we have to do is observe the difficulty we have maintaining a Sabbath rhythm. Um, so this is pretty cool. This is just a little planner, and it looks like every day has a quote, and there are some scripture readings that you can do across the top. And I love planners because I'm all about writing things down. I just cannot get into the habit of putting things into my phone or into the calendar on my computer. I'm still old school and I like to write down everything. Um, so this one we have is the little impact guide. So this comes with every box and this gives you a rundown of the things that are in the box. Um, so let's see the overview on this one says, one of the greatest temptations we face is that it's easy to be selfish. In fact, it's easier to be selfish than to be selfless. This is a struggle we all relate to as imperfect humans. The impulse to accumulate more things and store us, uh, store up a copious amount of wealth has been and continues to be one of our greatest temptations. This self, selfishness stands in stark contrast with the gospel, with what the gospel asks of us to be people abundant in gratitude and generosity. Being grateful for what we have is an effective tool for resisting the urge for more. And this devotional lays out a number of scriptures, practices, and prayers to help orient ourselves toward being grateful for all of the goodness in our lives. Giving thanks to God is the first and foremost practice of gratitude, after all. Every good and perfect gift is from above. And this gives you, you know, a rundown of the why we love sacred planner or sacred ordinary days, what that's about. There, ooh, there is a candle in here from this Legacy Candle Co., um, this is candles with a purpose. Ooh, and it smells really good. It's called Old Holy Night, and it's a hand poured soy wax candle. And it looks like they are from Columbus, Ohio, and they support former victims of human human trafficking and create products that are globally sourced and locally crafted. Um, the other that is in here, ooh, who does not love a good bar of chocolate? This is awesome. This is orga organic and fairly traded dark chocolate and caramel crunch with sea salt. And this is from Equal Exchange. They are one of the oldest and largest co cooperative in the county, and, and they're an alternative 
for-profit structure that's based on standard democratic principles, and they aren't designed to maximize pro pro profits, <laughs> but rather to bring many of the rights and responsibilities we hold as citizens to the workplace. You like that candle? Yeah. All right, and then, of course, last but never least, is the <coughs> daily devotional. Hi. Yeah, Do you want to be on camera? Yeah. Oh, and last but not least is the daily devotional, and I spoke about this last time. So this is a 30-day devotional that gets you through to the next box. So once your box comes, you just start, and by the time you finish, you have a, another box that's here and ready to pick up for the Daddy, next 30 days. Stop! <laughs> Thank you guys Daddy, very much for watching. Stop. Have a blessed day, and uh, I'll be back to do another video soon. Bye. bye. Can you say bye? Bye.